Yo, what's going on YouTube? Jake Cameo here, and welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon Fire Red Randomized Nuzlocke, episode 29. So, last episode, I believe we took on... Yeah, so I believe last time we took on um, <clears throat> Blaine and his gym. Oh, uh, so we have the option to go to one island. I don't know if I want to yet or not. So before we do that, let's try... Actually, before we do anything, let's go ahead and have a team recap. Because it's been a little bit before since I've played this. So we have our level 44 Sherman, who is bold nature, holding deep sea scale. With Stench as his ability because he's a stanky boy. Then he has Earthquake, Dizzy Punch, Mock Punch, and Rock Blast as his moves. Then we have our level 40 Florida, who is Hasty Nature holding Scope Lens. The Shell Armor as her ability. With Outrage, Thunder, Silver Wind, and Cut. And then we have our level 40 Sweet Heat, who is Sassin Nature. With Drizzle as his ability, with Drill Peck, Mega Horn, Mega Kick, and Shadow Ball. We have a level 40 Xander, who is Modest Nature, holding Wax Incense, with huge powers as ability, with Hyper Beam, Yawn, Mega Kick, and Brick Break. Then we have our level 42 Sylvia, who changed genders and is now a male with Lax Nature, with poison holding Poison Barb, with Cacophony as his ability, with Surf Extreme Speed, Heat Wave, and Sludge Bomb. And then our newest member, our level 40 Karen, with, who is Quirky Nature, with Shell Armor as her ability, with Extra Sensory, Strength, Blast Burn, and Rock Blast. So, okay, that is our team. That's who we're going to be rocking out with. So, let us go onward. And I believe if we just keep going, then we'll be able to go to the next gym. Or we might have to go to one island. I don't know. But we'll find out. Swimmer Jerome. Saita! Bruh. Sherman's got this on lock. Oh. I don't have a drink. I typically have something to, something to drink while I stream or record. But I just noticed I do not. Oh, sad day, sad day. Anyway, Sherman's gonna go ahead and level up to 45. Bruh. Sherman is so powerful. I love his Sherman so much. I'm terrified of the Elite Four because I just know something's gonna happen to our poor, poor Sherman. Would you change Pokemon? For Salamence? Please. Please. We got this Rock Blast. What's up, homie? Oh, snap, we missed. Air cutter, air cutter, though. No. Bruh, Sherman. Whoa, bruh, bruh. I was just hyping you up, homie. I was, well, I was kind of sort of hyping you up. Okay, so he got confused, Ray. He got confused. So we're gonna go ahead and switch out to. Oh no, not Florida, because air cutter will mess you up. We're gonna go into. Now I just looked at your move. What are your moves again? Nothing too good. Okay. You have Rock Blast. Let's try Karen. Bleh. Not too bad, not too bad, not too bad. Rock Blast! Oh my goodness, Karen. You missed too, girl? You missed too. Oh my goodness. What are we gonna do with you guys? There we go. One. Okay, it should be about four hits and it'll do it. Two, three. One more. There we go. Good job, Karen. Critical hit. And it's super effective. Alright, so that does it for Swimmer Jerome. So let us continue onward. I'm just gonna go straight line. Call my Pokemon at C. Swimmer Jack. 
Jackson Tell Snow Run! Oh snap, that's actually. If it's got a stab move, that's super effective. We got we got smock punch, but I don't know. I feel more comfortable going into Man, Eyesight messes us up for real. It's three three Pokemon that Eyesight just destroys. We're gonna try Xander. We haven't I feel like we haven't seen Xander in a little, in a little bit, so I'm gonna try Xander. Lovely kiss. And Xander goes immediately to sleep. Okay. So we're gonna need you to wake up, buddy. We're gonna need you to wake up and one punch this thing. So it's got submission, which is not gonna do anything to Xander. Snow Run is hit with recoil even. Come on, bruh. Submission. Go ahead and get that recoil damage, bruh. Check it. Check it, Xander's about to wake up right now and wreck your face. Nice knowing you, Snow Runt. Peace out. Diver, down! I guess we could battle those guys, but eh. Bruh, Bayonet? Or bayonet. I always say bayonet for some. I almost always say bayonet for some reason. But let's go ahead and. Oh, it's only level nine. Psh, well, I mean, um, f that. I almost said a cuss word. I try not to cuss in my Pokemon uh, content because Pokemon is, in fact, suited for younger ages. So. Uh, there's really no need for us to do anything here. Do do do, loo loo loo. I got some apples. Loo loo loo. You got some too. Loo loo loo. Let's get together. Put our apples together. Loo loo loo. Oh, we were one, we were one step away. We get this infamous mill tanks that we saw in the beginning of our playthrough. Oh, right there. Now onward to Viridian City, where we will try. Is it even possible? Looks like he's still standing in front of it, so we may have to go to one island. Oh no, he's not standing in front of it. Ooh. Ooh, so we could possibly get go ahead and get our um Duma Flitchy in this episode. Let's see here. Ooh. Ooh. Wait, do we have fly? Do we even have fly? Where am I going? What am I doing? Not that. Uh, TM case, there we go. We do not. We don't have like anything. We still need like Rock Smash and yeah, we still need Rock Smash and Fly. We've basically beat the game. Huh. Interesting. May have to look that up in the next episode. But for now, <clears throat> I'm going to try. I'm going to try and see if we can take on the Viridian Gym. All the way around here. Oh boy. Yo, champ in the making. Even I don't know the Viridian leader's identity. But one thing's certain, this will be the toughest of all the gym leaders. Also, I heard that the trainers here like ground type Pokemon. Well, if that's the case, if that's the case, Sylvia will definitely be able to take him out. Your Pokemon will cower at the crack of my whip. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> <coughs> Tamer Cole. Now, Agron, which is actually pretty decent against Sylvia. 
Like, we are actually a pretty decent matchup. We're gonna go Surf and see if we can take this thing out in one hit, though. Yeah, baby, there we go, Sylvia. Our Cthulhu. Crawdont. We will go into... Let's go into Xander. Because I'm pretty sure Crawdont is dark type. Dark water. So, let's test out that theory. Because I'm pretty sure that's the case. I'm almost, I'm like 90% positive. So. Because Corefish and Crawdont were Pokemons that I loved when the, the anime and everything was out for the third gen. Alright. Karate is the ultimate form of martial arts. Black Belt Kyo. Subbed out Arjados. Hmm. Could try Heat Wave. Let's, let's see what it does. Probably nothing. Level 43 Arjados. Bruh. Hey, super effective. <clears throat> Sylvia gained one, two, three, four experience. That was cool. I don't think I've ever seen that. Alright, pal. Hey, you must be running out of steam by now. Cool trainer, Yuji. Kaknya! Yo, please tell me you guys have seen uh, the, the Pokey Roast episode from The King Nappy. Uh, with Shady Penguin and uh, Nexus, Num Nexus, because that was hilarious. Shady had to defend uh, Cacnea and, um, oh goodness, Quilava. Ooh. Uh, no, actually, we were going to stay in and surf Quilava. Um, <clears throat> but it was, uh, and uh, Num Nexus had to uh, basically roast or you know, insult Cacnea. It was just so funny. Bruh. Can you swim, Quilava? The answer is no. Cascoon. We can switch up for Cascoon. Let's give Sweet Heat the tiniest of experience with this Cascoon. You know, we're actually slightly underleveled on most of our mods. Well, maybe not, because some of theirs is like, are like level 30 something. But then we had that uh, Aria that was like level 43. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> Parasect! Nah, sweet, he can stay in. Parasect! we do for Krabby? I know we can do Thunder. Do we really want to do that? We can do Outrage. That'd be nice. Let's go Florida and Outrage. Krabby with Extreme Speed. Now I've seen everything. That's a decent chunk. I'm not gonna lie, that is a decent chunk. Oh, I went to the mart and I saw that they had garbage in that mart. And I forgot to check and see what our items even are. So let me check and see if we have any potions and such.
Three, seven super potions. One full restore. Okay, we got like 29 high promotions. We are good. We are good to go. But actually, let's organize this a tiny bit. Because that's going to get some nerves. Super potion. And our singular max potion. Okay, and then... There's something else I wanted to move up. What was it? Uh, maybe repel? No, nah, not repel. There's only two of those, so... Full heal, maybe? That must have been what I was wanting to move up. I can't remember, but... Let's go ahead and move that up as well. Actually, one more thing, because I'll kind of want to move up that for a store, just in case. <clears throat> there we go. That looks a lot better. That looks a lot better. Okay. So let's use a couple super potions. Do we even need to use a couple? I'm pretty sure I probably want it good now. Yeah, I probably want it good now. Well, let's keep it going. Roar! I'm working myself into a rage. I keep looking around for something to drink because I'm uh, again, like I said, I'm used to having something to drink here. Uh, I'm gonna have to fix that before the next episode. Sedge bomb. Nice shade. Uh oh. That's nice shade. Nice shade actually did a lot of damage. Oh. Let's try our extreme speed. Ayy. She'll be a good level 43. Black belt. Asushi is about to use Nidorain. Nidorina. Let's go into Shermin. Shermin is the perfect Pokemon for Nidorina. Earthquake! Just when you thought it was safe, 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 safe. Pokemon and I, we make wonderful music together. I used to love Quagsire. I used to absolutely love Quagsire when I was a kid. I don't remember why, but it's true. I did. I used to absolutely love Quagsire. We have nothing for Quagsire, do we? Try a sludge bomb. Maybe we'll get a poison? I don't know. That does nothing. Nothing. Bro. Chill out, chill out, chill out, chill out, chill out, chill out. Maybe, maybe Xander can take him out. Transformed into a normal type? Bro, Dunsky, you are so done. BOOM! It probably would have survived if it did not do that. You are in perfect harmony.
the truly talented win with style. The truly talented win with style. Warren. Octillery. Oh snap, I forgot to do the thing with you. So we're gonna switch you out, homie. We'll switch you out, Sylvia. I got you. String shot. Oh no. Whatever shall we do? Yo, hold this. Sky uppercut. That's a fighting type, right? That's still a decent amount. Yo, but hold this. Tunda. Boom. Boom. Get out of here. Get out of here. Not a day. Greet level 41. Sharpedo. Psh. I used to absolutely love Sharpedo as well. And Carvana. I used to love Carvana a lot more than Sharpedo just because of its color scheme. Its color scheme is amazing. I love the red and orange and all that. So good. Because you don't see that kind of coloring in water Pokemon really. And water Pokemon has always been, uh, water typing has always been my favorite type of Pokemon. So it made me really happy to see those colors on a Pokemon like that. Nectric. Oh, we got this. This Germinator. Just when you thought it- oh snap, fake out. Just when you thought it was safe, 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 safe. Dun, 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 dun. Meditate. Sweet heat! We need your shadow ball! Why not? Let's go into. Let's just, let's try Karen and hope Swine Up does not have a earthquake or anything. I love Swine Up so much. He's so cute. Blast burn. Hey, good job, Karen. I lost my grip. Uh, I'm the Karate King. Your fate rests with me. Takashi. <laughs> I keep forgetting to heal Sylvia. Okay, okay. It's a good thing that uh, Xander's a physical type. He likes to one punch. Okay, sometimes he two punches. That's okay. I'm gonna end this in style. Xander, Hyper Beam. Mewtwo. Can Sweet Heat take out a Mewtwo? It 
Level 38. Blaze again! And it's charming! Oh no! The most charming Mewtwo ever! Yo, that didn't squat. What about Mega One? It's physical, so maybe. Hyper Beam. Sweet Heat, please no. Holy crap, it did half. Okay, Mewtwo must recharge. It, yo, if Sweet Heat missed that, it would have been over for Sweet Heat. There we go, baby. Whew, Sweet Heat making me nervous, boy. Executor. Normally, I would send it. Uh, <laughs> okay. Okay, okay, okay. Nothing. Bro, come on, sweetie. Come on, buddy. Sweetie, I need you to wake up, buddy. Feel those raindrops on your face and wake on up, buddy. Sweet heat, man. Sweet heat has been so powerful up until now. So, sadly, that's all the time we have for this episode. What a way to end it. Let's just go ahead. We're going to end it by putting him in Dunsky. And... Now, the original squad is taking a hit now. Man. Stacy, Gerald, and Sweet Heat. Oh my goodness. So, next episode we will be grabbing one of these Pokemon. Or, I should say, before next episode, because I'll probably grab it right about now and train it up real quick, because I doubt any of them are close to level 40 right now. But, I'll train one of these guys up. And we will be back in the next episode with a brand new party member and take on Giovanni and hopefully destroy him with no casualties. 
So, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked this episode, hit that like button down below. If you're part of the Cameo Core, definitely hit that like button down below. Show me some love. And if you're not a part of the Cameo Core and would like to be, all you have to do is hit that subscribe button and you're automatically a part of the Cameo Core. So thank you guys so much for watching. You guys are awesome. And remember, always love from your core.